Hello, I am Dr. Von Witzburger, and today we are going to be examining my patient as of late. She suffers from mild hallucinations, possibly on the range, and I have been examining her in therapy. I really should not be documenting this on video and putting it up on the internet, but you know what? They said the kids, they love that shit. So I'm going to put it up there for everybody to see. So without further ado, I give you Robin. She is my star pupil, as I have been training her in the ways of the mind, and we are going to be examining how she has been doing. Thus, she has not been doing very good, but we shall see her progress. We are going to be examining her as she goes through her weekend days. She feels she's lazy. She feels super tired. But what she does not know is subconsciously I have implanted a little device in her head allowing me to control her all the weekend. And she is going to do exactly as I say every time I give her a command. And she will do it without falter. This should be good. And as you know, everybody should always start the day with a good breakfast, a good meal. It's good, it's hearty. And look, her meter for insanity has gone up. Or is it down? I'm not sure. I'm only a class A doctor, but I'm not sure how things work. Washing dishes, also a good part of the daily day. Make sure you get your chores done and on time, and you will have a good time. What's that? Her bird is also named Robin? Yes, I told her to name her bird Robin. That way, if she ever has any doubts as to what she is doing, she can call upon her bird friend, which is also her name, and it is her spirit animal. She is connected with the bird on more than just a physical lever. Also, reading? Reading is also very good in time. She wishes to be a doctor just as me, Dr. Von Witzburger, and she must read to be smart. Also taking care of her dirty ass clothes. That would be nice. But it seems that Robin has decided she does not have time for that. And here, here is the list of things she has done for the day. She has looked over at her underwater plants. You shouldn't have forgotten them. You really should not have forgotten them, Robin. You're gonna have to tend to those tomorrow. Okay? In fact, that's priority one. What are your damn plants, woman? Get them done. Okay, clean up. Clean up after yourself. That's what this day is all about. Therapy. Forget therapy. Read your books. Read, clean up. Why, 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 are, you, why are you so busy? Robin, go to bed. Go to bed. Your weekend's over. Your weekend's over. You wasted it. It's all wasted. Okay. I thought that weekends were only in two day spans. I must have a different weekend than these people. Surely, after day three, she must be able to go- Oh, hello, this is Robin's progress. Robin speaking to you. Robin has gotten through the weekend, but barely. Her plants are dying, she hasn't eaten properly, and the place is a mess. She realizes that she is the paying for her mistakes in the coming week. She dreads working, going to work the next day. Oh well, she would have to go to work. Everybody has to work. Got to make that money, that sweet, sweet money. I mean, look at me, goddammit. Do you think I like being this? Do you think I like to go off and treat people? Hell no! I do it for the money. Robin? She's nothing but the money trap to me. In my eyes, she's just money. That's my job. Do I care about her on a social level? No. Do I care about her on a patient level? Yes. Because she pays the bills. But that's enough from Robin. How are you doing? I hope you're doing good. And hey, if you're watching this documentary on Robin and you enjoyed it, please don't forget to shoot the like button to keep it awesome. And don't forget to stay awesome because you are awesome and I will catch you in the next of whatever I do. Maybe on a documentary of my next patient and I will see you later. Ciao!